In this video, I want to have a look at finding the correlation coefficient using your Sharp calculator. So your calculator might look a little bit different if you've got the newer version, but the settings are all the same, the modes and all the buttons are in the same place as well. Mine are a little bit worn off too, but I'll just tell you what they are. All right, so our question says the heights and arm spans of 10 senior students are shown in the table below, and it asks us to calculate the correlation coefficient correct to three decimal places. So the first thing we're going to need to do is to put our calculator in the right statistics mode. So you're going to press mode, which is here. Um, stats, so number one. Now when we were using our calculators to find the mean and the standard deviation, we were using this statistics mode. Because we're using bivariate data though, we're going to have to use this one. So you're going to press one. All right, so now we need to start entering our data. So we want to enter it all in pairs. So for this first one, their height is 160, their arm span is 162. So we're going to write 160, then this STO button will give us a comma and we'll enter their arm span, so 162. Then we'll press M plus to enter that into the memory. So we need to do that for all of our data now. So the next one. Okay, so all our data is in there now. It tells us that we've entered 10 pieces of data, which is what we wanted. Um, if you've got 9 or 11, you know something's gone wrong and you need to go back and change it. All right, so to calculate the correlation coefficient now, we know that it's represented by the letter R. On your calculator, that's just above your division key. It's written in green. So to get that, we need to press alpha to get to the green ones. So alpha and then your division key gives us that R, for correlation coefficient, and then press enter or equals. So that gives us a correlation of about 0.965 to three decimal places. So that's a really strong positive correlation between height and arm spin. All right, so that's how to calculate the correlation coefficient with your Sharp calculator.